together. We're already facing south, or perhaps you want to stretch out a hand toward the city of Toronto, and let us pray over this city, let's pray over our nation. God will still hear us. How many know he's a prayer answering God? And we come into agreement, the word of God said, if any two agree, it shall be done. And I come into agreement with Pastor Tech that what we shall offer in prayer will be reached unto the heart of God and that there will be a movement of God's Spirit that will make a difference in this nation. Mighty God, we realize there is no God like our God. Though there be many gods throughout the earth, they are just made with the hands of men. But we have a God that created all things, a God who has established His great kingdom, a God that has purposed mighty things, not only for Israel, but also for Canada. We thank you for this night and that we are remembering a people that you have raised up to impact and bless nations around the earth. And so, Lord, Canada is a recipient of this blessing. But we have moved away from our moorings and bring us back again. May we realize the importance of the Word of God and that we must humble ourselves as this prayer of song was offered to you. We do humble ourselves. We do turn from wicked ways. We repent. And Lord, we realize when we do this, then you will come and forgive us of our sins. You will heal our land. There will be a restoration for this nation of Canada. We thank you for a prime minister who is a God-fearing, God-believing man. We pray for Stephen Harper tonight. We pray for his candidate. We pray for every member of Parliament that there will arise in Ottawa a mighty godly force that will release righteousness across this nation and that the Word of God will be strongly proclaimed. Oh, Father God, let the angels of the Lord encamp around about our nation. Drive out the works of wickedness. Let righteousness rise within the hearts of your people. Let your people declare again their bold faith with great conviction that they believe in the Lord God of Abraham, Isaac, and of Jacob. So, Father, preserve your purpose and let the glory of the Lord be visited upon this nation and let many turn unto you that we may see the purpose of God fulfilled in these days, we pray, and even to the coming of Messiah. So we thank you for it, Lord, and give you praise for this, as we ask it in the name of Yeshua HaMashiach. Amen. 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 Where did they come from? <laughs>